Hey guys, Nate here. Welcome to a uh, sort of layout update. I say sort of because nothing has really been messed around too much. I did have a circle of track, an oval track. If you guys have watched the previous video a while back, so, that I had a loop of track. I was just running around. Well, kind of was debating on pulling the trigger on actually going a full fledged layout. Well, I decided to do that. But I do have a haul for today. Not a very big one. Just a couple things I picked up. First thing I picked up is I got this just plug truck, stake truck for uh, testing. And then got these three pack of Penzi hoppers. And what I'm thinking about doing actually is you see these hoppers has a pre-mounted plate and screw system for KD couplers. I'm actually considering going to that so I can do some switching which would be easier than trying to use the knuckle couplers. And it's not there's anything wrong with these. It's just they're hard to close. Sometimes you have to really smack on them. And then the last item is I got this Atlas switch. This is a 7254 curve switch. Which I need for something in the, a future expansion that I plan on once I get through the main part of the layout. And then the last thing I want to talk about is I found out these locomotives had some issues and the only reason why I found out about it was mine was acting very strange it was jerky when it was running come to find out that they had a bug from Lionel I found it of course a year later unfortunately but one of the things that was talked about was that the traction tires might have been the problem and what I did was I actually have cut the traction tire out of the wheel. I found it was so close to the molded brake detail down here. And the locomotive still, despite the fact there's no traction tire, has a decent amount of pull to it, even without. And I'm not worried because these, these, these little two six O's never really pulled more than 10 cars usually. Maybe 20 because they were made for locals, milk milk trains, that kind of thing. Just small local town to town work. Nothing major. So I can live without traction tires. Other than that, it's a good locomotive, I think. So this will be the main locomotive that I will be using on the layout, other than one or two others. As the layout I have planned, it will be a steam era transition layout. And I look forward to it. Like I said, this is an unofficial update slash hobby store run. And I look forward to making videos and hope you guys enjoy them in the future.